Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome to the channel and welcome back to the glorious Overwatch Guess the Rank. And we find ourselves today on the wonderful, the absolutely beautiful Numbani. Let's bring up the UI and let's get stuck into this because this is Guess the Rank. You guys know how this works. It is a beautiful game show where we try and guess the rank of submitted gameplay. There, there, there. Submitted is the word I'm looking for. Gameplay clips. Now, if you guys want to submit a replay, then go to unitloss.com forward slash gtr there is a link in the video description below and today i have been told this is a difficult guess the rank for one simple reason it's a boosted mercy or is it a mercy doing the boosting well for give sty some help the submission says <laughs> this is not a boosted mercy this is a mercy doing the boosting what what <laughs> what what please don't be a battle mercy please oh no it's a mercy called gamer girl everything looks like it's going to be beautiful this mercy's going to do some work she's going to do some damage and i can't wait to see it all right let's jump on board with mercy it's going to be beautiful so yeah remember guys if you want to send video clips in for consideration to appear on this wonderful show then do click that link in the video description below and do consider joining the channel, which does help a hell of a lot. <laughs> You'll get crazy emotes. And also, I'll give you a shout out at the end of every GTR, Bronze Heroes, and Overanalyzed. Oh, yeah. All right, then. So, we're damage boosting the Junkrat. And um, the movement's kind of clunky at the moment. I'm not going to lie. Kind of clunky. Okay, we're in a decent position, though. Some nice healing there. We've, we're going across to help Anna. Uh, yeah, our front line's all on the low ground. See, what I'm worried about here is we're all on the low ground. We've committed to a low ground fight. That says to me that this probably isn't diamond or above because they would be in a high ground position. It wouldn't just be all fighting on the low ground. And Mercy, though, is showing some a pretty nice movement here. Jumping around. Bit of Guardian Angel all over the place. Prioritizing the damage boost on the Junkrat. When she can, which you've got to respect. Cheeky little heel. This is not... This is pretty good. Nice little uh, super jump kind of bit of tech on the show there. This is nice. This is nice. This isn't what I expected. I thought we were going to see a ridiculous nice heel there. Absolutely clutch heel there. You've got to love it. Although we have lost our Arissa, which is not too great. We do nearly have Valk ready. So we should just pop that straight away. Because there's a high noon, which... Okay, didn't really do anything. <laughs> It was their high noon and our high noon. There was two high noon. What? Was there two high noons there? I don't know. This is a... Okay, what? Oh, oh my God. You know what? We we need to go back here. We absolutely need to go back because this is like... Hang on. Let's just go back here because what the hell happened there? there was, was there two high noons? So both McCree's are on 60, 70%. <laughs> yeah, they are. Look, they're both on 70. These McCree's are literally at the same percent. What? What? The hell these th by the way this is a this is a mega clutch save on this McCree. he should be dead to this genji does he flash him yeah he fl the flash saves him but then you come down and save him so this is beautiful also blizz 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 i turn this off every time and then i forget to turn it back off again because you reset the bloody options on every replay come on so that's huge that is actually huge that mercy play there is huge excellent play mercy i'm loving your work anyway our mccree there mccree their mccree's there I think these McCree's high noon at the same time. Okay, there's our high noon. Can he even... Can this McCree... Okay, but anyway, it looks like we're losing this fight here. But this, this, this goes beautiful. This is... Yo, this really is sick mercy play. I'm loving it. So, nice res. Pop the Valk. Or we'll pop the valve in a second. Nice little bit of tech there again. Loving it. Although it was slightly exposed, but who cares? And McCree just goes in and dies again. Whatever. Imperfect play, you could say. <laughs> oh, we didn't even valve. I thought we valve. I thought we went in with a big valve. Okay. See, I don't mind Mercy's burning valve. Because valve can charge it pretty quick. And, like, it's not the greatest of support ultimates in the game. So I don't really care if you want to use it to go for a cheeky recontest. Although, look, look. Avarissa there again. You know, this is pretty good Mercy play. I don't think... Oh, my God. I'm literally basic... Okay, flank McCree. I'm basing... Let's see. Nice tech. Nice. 
Nice attack. Nice attack. Oh, yeah. This is this really is quite difficult. Okay, we're going in with the Valk now. Right, straight into the middle of a fight. Big res. But that's on our hog. That's good. We need to get out of the way of this. Oh, God, no. Okay, they're using every ult. We should just all die here. All right, okay. So they use Sigma ult, High Noon, Blade. You, we couldn't really do anything about that. That's fine. So what this feels like... I don't know what this feels like. This I think this is a Platinum game. Hmm. I think this is like 2,700, I want to say. Because I'm seeing some nice Mercy movement. Nice Mercy play. But I'm a little bit concerned about our team taking up just like a low ground position at the start of the defensive phase, which is very concerning because no team would really do that if they were... Like, that's kind of like a gold thing. Like, I want to... Ooh, that's like a gold play. Also, I don't really care about completely losing the streets phase here. It's a pointless part of the map. Crappy map design where the first point is basically... Th this map is basically 2CP in disguise, right? That's what it is. We have a pointless middle section that is impossible to defend. <laughs> so, GG, Bliss, good job. Maybe, maybe they'll fix this kind of stuff. They watch you, who knows? Anyway, we're getting pushed back here. This is not good for us. Okay, that res is bad. That's the first bad play you've made so far. Because we've just basically rezzed our Anna to get killed. And then she gets killed again. So that's not great. So that's now making me think, is this really plat? Could this be below plat? But I don't know. I think at the moment, I'm kind of like 2,600, 2,700. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Okay, so we've got Reinhardt now. Mm, okay, makes sense for this point. Going in with the Valve. Oh, be careful of that. High Noon. It looks like we're, we're respecting the High Noon. We've got to respect it and we're loving it. Okay, this is a good play. Good play. Good play. Okay, big healing. Okay, nice. So we should secure this. Okay. So we did have a nano boost in Reinhardt and we've got our Valk committed there. But like I said, I, don't, I really don't care when Mercy's pop Valk. It's like, it's it's okay. It's just like, it's not very good Blizzard. <laughs> We've been over this a lot of times before. Hey, it makes you feel great because you can fly everywhere, but it's just a bit like, nah. All the other supports have got impact ultimates. When they use them, it's an impact. Mercy's is just like, well, Mercy's kind of hard to kill now and everyone gets an AoE heal or damage boost. Mm. I guess Mercy could pull out the Glock and just start killing people. Which, I'm going to be honest, this is what I was expecting based off the, the tip that I was sent in with this replay. Okay, nice Junkrat. Nice, nice, nice. But what we are seeing here is a nice, like... Uh, you know, I like this when we see players using class or hero-specific tech. I like that. I really like that because it shows that you... You know, you, 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 you enjoy playing the hero. And this has always been the thing with Overwatch, right? A, a rant's about to come in, ladies and gentlemen. With Blizzard wasting literally years trying to get people to play all kinds of different heroes when they basically built what is essentially a superhero game where people are going to pick one of the superheroes and bloody one trick them aren't they yes blizzard yes they are anyway <laughs> let's 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 go for it i'm not saying that's a bad thing guys you know it's a good thing because you're going to get you're going to spend time with the hero you're going to get good you're going to know the ins and outs it's beautiful i don't know what our winston's doing he's got he's all no he doesn't Although he is nano boosted. That's a really good play there by uh, Anna. See, so I'm liking the aggression here. He needs to get out though, Winston. He's overstaying his welcome. We need to make sure he gets out. Nice play off our Reinhardt to get up there and help him. So like this here again, I like this. The team is getting aggressive. The team is moving forward. Yeah, I know we've got a Junkrat. Whatever, not optimal. The enemy team have got a Genji. Well, Genji at the moment is... I thought he would be a lot better than he, than he is. And he kind of isn't. Like Genji's still suffering. Um, still down there as like a bottom tier DPS. I mean, Junkrat's probably better than Genji <laughs> at this moment in time. I mean, Junkrat's good in certain... Like, Junkrat, to be fair, is fairly good on this point here because you just... Like, you're walking down a choke. You're going to take loads of damage. And I don't know what our guy's doing over there. This McCree is trash. Like, he's actually trash. Oh, no. Okay. It, it seems that they really like to use this combo, which is um, everybody press Q at the same time. <laughs> and it works for them, which is fine. Now, the problem we've got, right, so if we look at our team comp here, and I'm, I am going to be critical of the Anna Mercy uh, here. We can't stop Genji. Like, the only way we can stop this Genji blade is if Winston primals him around, uh, McCree flashes him and kills him. But if he gets nanoed as well, then it's, it's pretty much good night Vienna for us as a team. This is where we do need a Zen. We do need maybe even a Lucio or something to try and deflect that because it is what is winning them fight after fight after fight. It is what the win condition is for the enemy team. And that's okay, right? But uh, Valkyrie's not really going to save us from that. And and so is Nano Boost. It's 
they're just not gonna they're not gonna make it happen. So this is gonna be difficult for us now to hold this. Hopefully we can. But I don't think we it's gonna be super difficult. This res Actually that is a super clutch barrier there if I Winston, but I don't know whether it's gonna keep him alive. No, he's gonna go down. But he did get our McCree back in the game. You know what? I'm a McCree with you pocketing him. We're about to get Valk again now. Hmm. Okay, nice Guardian Angel. Just insta Valk. Love it. We need that regen. We need that healing. We need that survivability. We've got it. We're keeping our Reinhardt alive. That nano boost is keeping him alive. We're still losing people in the back line. Is this where we see the Glock? No. Damage boost in that Winston. You know, so really clutch tank play. I really liked when that Winston came in with his bubble. I know he was just jumping on the payload and dropping his bubble down, but it actually shielded us to get the res onto that McCree. If he didn't do that, I think we're dead. So that's actually a really good play there. But this is pretty good mercy play overall, though. But like I said with my little rant, you know, it's the biggest joke of Overwatch where, you know, you look at the teams here and you go, yeah, okay, on paper, get off the Mercy or, I mean, get off the Ana, whatever, and give us a Lucio, give us a Zen, give us something to stop this Genji just killing us. Or when they had a Genji. Um, obviously, they swapped the Trace just to get back quick. And it's like, well, no, because people want to play these heroes that have been, you know, wonderfully designed and... Yeah, it's just like, what I, I really hope that gets fixed with Overwatch 2. It's one of the biggest issues the game's had for a long, long time. And it is super frustrating as well. Because, like, you know, the, the way to get good at Overwatch is to pick a hero and just play the hell out of that hero. And then you will get good with that hero. And then, yeah, you can pick another hero and do it again and again and again, sure. But you're not going to you're not going to just... You don't want to be mediocre at a bunch of heroes because there'll come a point where that won't be good enough. And that's... Just the reality of Overwatch. All right, so we've got Winston, Brian Hart, Tank Line. We've got a Tracer, uh, which uh, we still got a Junkrat. Uh, they've got a Doomfist now. Uh, we could probably help our Winston up there. We should probably help our Winston. Okay. Okay, our Ryan's in pretty deep. Oh, okay, this is bad. This is really bad. So that there was not great play there. Like, it was lucky you managed to get out there. But I know why you were going in. You're trying to keep them alive. But I'm just going to pause this, actually, because this, you know what, is pretty good. In terms of, like, where I think this rank is, I still think this is a platinum game. I still think this is, like, a 2,700 game. I'm going to say it's 2,700 at the moment. Um, but what I'm liking about this is our team are engaging here. Our Winston, okay, he's in a iffy position here. He's He might kill the Mercy, actually. She's 1 HP, so he might kill that Mercy. That's pretty good. But our team are in. And this is the, the good thing about this. Our team are in fighting the enemy team. But the enemy team are pretty much all on the low ground. Now, I know they were pushed off. Maybe they were pushed off by the Winston from the high ground, but I don't know. They should have held their ground and they've dropped down to the low ground. Again, that's telling me this is probably a platinum game. But, um, yeah, the fact the team have just gone in, they've committed, it causes problems for the enemy. They've got to try and deal with it. Okay, this is risky. That is super risky. Yeah, that is that is actually brain dead. Like, <laughs> There's, we don't res next to a Doomfist. He will just kill us. If he doesn't interrupt us with his abilities, he will kill us. I think we're okay, though, because he's just... Yeah, we should cap the point still. The enemy will probably start trickling onto the point now. Their tank should be coming back. Their Doomfist messing about. Meteor Strike onto the Ana. That should go. It's not going to matter, though. Uh, I think he tried to get it onto the Ana, but I think she put him to sleep. <laughs> I think she put him to sleep. You know, we'll just leave that. We're not, I'm not even going to rewind it, but I think... You know what? We will. We will, because I think she put him to sleep there. I could see the sleep animation through the wall. I'm pretty sure she got him and put him to sleep. Let's have a look at this. <laughs> I mean, like, look at the ticker. Like, it's literally... Oh, I can see what he's trying. Okay, so he just goes for the payload. Yeah. <laughs> You gotta love it. You absolutely gotta love it. All right, gamer girl, get back in the fight. Okay. So, yeah, taking a nice position. See, it's just nice. It's nice to play our Tracer dead, though. Like, I, we have got a really bad... You know what? I'm going to jump on board with this Tracer when she respawns. Because that player seems really bad. Let's have a look. Seems really, really bad. Let's see what they do. Uh, <laughs> what was that soldier doing? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> okay, I don't know what was going on there. Like, honestly, guys, don't waste your ults like that. This phase, no one cares. It's super difficult to hold this phase. 
Like, don't waste your ults. Oh, my lord. Like, they... I think he swapped his hero, right? Okay, he's gone to Reaper for some reason. I mean, the soldier was kind of okay. But that's me because I like soldiers. So I'm like, yeah, soldier's okay. Okay, nice foul. This looks very winnable for us. We're just going to wreck them. Nice positioning again. We've got a good view of everything that's happening. Although we have lost our tracer again, but we don't care. Literally a bot. We don't even care. Just don't even play. Riptide is going to be big. Okay, nice res. That res is fine because we're winning this fight. We need to get that Winston if we can. Yep, massive. We're already 25% to another ulti again. This is really good. We've got a ton of momentum. We want to go forward here. Yeah, just support the Winston. I'd just go forward with the Winston. I'd da you know what? I'd legit damage boost that Winston. Get in there and damage boost him. Give him, give him like agency. Give him permission to get in there and do damage. I like this. is a good game. This is good mercy play. All right. I think I'm going to say, because I mean, the tracer is very questionable. The tracer reeks of gold to me, <laughs> but I'm thinking this could like the mercy. Oh, I don't know. I like, I think this mercy is a plat mercy player easy. And if they're in gold, okay, whatever. But, like, I think they can get to flat easy. Probably even higher. Oof, this is a mess. Okay, we need to back out of this. Run away! All right, I think, like, 2,000... Yeah, I'm going to stick with it. I'm going to say 2,700. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to go 2,700 in this game. Just because I think what is giving it away is... Yeah, okay, the trace is not, not particularly great, but... But the thing is, that the team are actually playing quite well together. But it's just what they're doing together. They are... There's certain tells, isn't there, of Diamond Master, Grandmaster games, obviously, with positioning. Things like that, where that Doomfish just came in on the enemy team. Like, what the hell was that? Like, what, like, what was that? That Reaper play there is pretty decent. Should be able to heal our tank through that. Yeah, we're still winning this fight. We need to help our Winston if we can, although it's slightly risky. So, I don't know. I think it's just like an overall position thing with the teams, the way they're engaging. It feels like a platinum game to me. Based off all the replays I've watched over all these years. It feels like a black game. Go on, Winston. Winston Reinhardt is a, is a weird combo, but I guess it's worked. So, who can, who can complain? Okay. Right. Okay. Okay. Let me, let me fire up the... Let me just pause this and let me get off the screen. Okay. Let's have a look at this. So, this is, ladies and gentlemen... So I said it was 2,700. It's actually a 2,300 rated game. And now the difficulty for this was hard. And I, I think this Mercy player is better than gold. I, I'd be surprised if any of you guys in the comments actually think that that's a gold Mercy. I think that's way better than gold gameplay based off what I've seen. Honestly, way, way better. So you're a good player, gamer girl. Nice, nice stuff, nice stuff. Uh, <laughs> so there you go. I was wrong by 500 SR. <laughs> well, no, I, I, no, I'm not wrong. Blizzard are wrong. The game's wrong. That person should not be 2,300. I think they're just a, a better player than that. All right, then, guys. It is now time to give a shout out to everybody who supports the channel on the Sty value or the Sty WTF level. Now, the way you support the channel is literally click the join button below the video and you can join. It's like a Twitch subscription. If you think of it that way, it's really cool. Like this helps the channel amazingly well. So these are everybody on the Sty value level and above. You get a shout out at the end of every one of the bronze heroes. Guess the rank and overanalyze videos. And I apologize if I get your name wrong because I can already see a name here, which I literally cannot pronounce because it's French and I'm not French. So I apologize. <laughs> okay, Josh Connor. Jace Latzash. Oh, Jace, thank you. Uh, Ray Deans, FNA Gaming YouTube. Will Huzienga. Matthew Barnes, Barnston. <laughs> the Ordinary 1%. N Weather Service. Colin Sullivan. Martin Suspergi. This is the French one. Jerichau. I think. <laughs> Slade Wilson. <laughs> Skinny Aki. Martin Luckett. Ryan Echteld, Tony Greenman, Todd Krieger, Taraja, Marcus Rondon, James Strain, Barry Larry Bird. No, Bad Larry Bird. Sorry, Barry Larry. Who the hell is Barry? Bad Larry Bird. Uh, Grudion, or Grudion, Paul Stumpy. Oh, my Lord. Samuel Husted, <laughs> Hubert's play, 7XQCX. Who else is on the WTF level? What, not, uh, what absolute not? Burger Ragnarsson. Excellent biking name. Uh, Sahara, Julian PP, Raz, F 
Fix Nix, Adam Levine, Espresso78, O-T-T-O-M-M-W-W-W-Zig, <laughs> Charles Crane, Christopher Penn, Carl Brudvella. I hope you actually like how I pronounce your name there, because I know it doesn't sound anything like that, does it? <laughs> but thank you, Carl. <laughs> roast Beef Guy. I do like roast beef on a Sunday dinner. Michael Sandman. Robert Samurajak. Again, your name gets me every time. Beast46, Epic Gamer, and Potion Man. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. You're awesome. And I'll catch you, lovely lot, on the next one. Doodaloo.